he shed it all. <laughs> now it had to start. It, it was good that he shed it all. Amen. Yeah, but he's been good. Christ and the ever-present Holy Spirit to the officers, to all of you that are here, amen, yes. those that are veering by electronic means, we say God it is good, yes. Yes. Amen. Amen. and he keeps being good. Amen. Yes. Songwriter says he keeps on blessing me yes. over yes. and over again. Yes. Amen. Yes. Amen. Yes. Amen. I feel so thankful uh, to be here on this day and at this time. Yes. Uh, from the four red scriptures, uh, the 37th Psalm. We want to talk about I will trust in the Lord. All right. All right. Amen. Amen. I will trust in the Lord. We sang that song. Amen. <laughs> Until I die. Right. Amen. Uh, because if you get halfway and you quit, guess what? <laughs> Race not given to the swift to the strong, right. but to he who endures to the end. Amen. Trust. 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 Trust is important in our life. Yes. Amen. Amen. Trust and faith go hand in hand. Amen. Trust is defined as the assured resting of the mind of one person on the integrity, honor, justice, love, truth, and any other sound principle in another or in something. Amen. If if you don't trust me, you gonna do it because I prove myself trustworthy. Amen. 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 You you're not gonna uh, uh, be trusting in me, and I'm doing all those things that prove I'm untrustworthy. All right. Amen. I've told you 15 times I'm gonna help you, and 15 times I've not helped you. You're not gonna trust me to help you the 16th time. Amen. You might ask me, but you ain't trusting me. Amen. 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 The trust which the Christian has in God is an exemplification of the faith we have in God. Like I said, faith and trust go hand in hand. Amen. The greater the trust, the greater the faith. And the greater the faith, the greater the trust. Amen. Uh, 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 for when we have great faith in God, then we trust him Amen. to do what he said he would do. Well, mm -hmm. We all trust in something or someone. Amen. Amen. Uh, 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 I, I, I tell you, uh, 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 when we first got married, Sister Fuller didn't trust my driver. <laughs> <laughs> It doesn't matter where we were going, she wasn't going to sleep. Amen. After some years, I, I, I'm not sure, Sister Stewart, if she started to trust me or she just decided, well, if it's going to happen, it's going to happen. Amen. 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 But we all trust, and, and, and without trust, uh, uh, we just wither away. We worry ourselves to death uh -uh, because trust in people and things are part of living. All right. Amen. Amen. If if Sister Taylor didn't trust that vehicle that she drives, uh, uh, then she'd be telling uh, Deacon that you got to get me another one. <laughs> Amen. But she trusts that vehicle. Amen. So she'll run out of the house and jump in and zoop. She's gone. Amen. Amen. In today's society, we are forced to trust in God. Amen. Amen. Uh, I come to tell you that the, uh, with the uncertainties that we're facing, amen, uh, uh, we have to trust in God. My Lord. Amen. Uh, uh, with the 
pandemic and, and we don't know uh, whether the person we're standing next to in Walmart or wherever we might go to shop, whether they have it or not, and yeah. gonna pass it along to you. Well, right. amen. You know, some folk don't believe in wearing masks. Right. And they don't believe in giving you your six feet. All right, man. Right. Amen. 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 You have to remind them, amen. as I did on one occasion, I said, I need my six feet. <laughs> amen. amen. You might not be concerned about yours, but I need mine. All right. Amen. Amen. If we have to trust in God. Well, okay. uh, uh, the in uncertainties of life would drive us crazy if we didn't have a rock to trust in. Amen. He is our rock. Amen. Some folks trust in the family. Uh, uh, they become a clan and claim that uh, all I need yeah, is in my family. All right. Amen. If I need money, the family going to give it to me. Yeah. Uh, if I need transportation, somebody in my family is going to come and, and take me where I need to go. But it always concerned me, when you get sick, is there a doctor in your family? Mm -hmm. Amen. Uh, uh, and does that doctor specialize in what you need? All right. Amen. Amen. My doctor specializes. Because I'm in the family of God. Amen. Some trust in themselves, feeling that they are able to face any situation. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, and they feel like they can do this because I got a little money, yeah. got a little prestige, yeah. folks know me. Amen. So so I don't need to trust in anybody. Well, well I, I, I come to tell you, uh, be like uh, the Israelites down in Egypt. Where the Bible says uh, there arose another Pharaoh mm -hmm. that knew not Joseph, and then they began to oppress them. All right, Amen, Amen. You might know somebody today, but who says that person gonna be there mm -hmm. to stand up for you? Amen. I, I, I'm gonna leave that. I am, I'm not gonna say that. Mm -hmm. Amen. <laughs> Some trust in the government. All right. Amen. Uh, 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 they think that whatever they need, government programs will take care of them. Yeah. Amen. I come to tell you, if you haven't learned, you will learn. Amen. <laughs> the government will let you down. Yes, sir. Amen. Today, I say to you, to me, to all of us, that we need to trust in the Lord. Yes, sir. Amen. Amen. This 37th Psalm, uh, provides us with 17 commands that we are to do. And then it backs that up with 25 promises that God makes to us. Amen. When David penned this psalm, he was no longer a young man. Amen. He was dealing with some difficulties in life. Scholars believe that this was a time when David was facing some sickness at a time when his son Absalom was trying to wrestle the kingdom from him. Okay. Uh, uh, you do know that that David's reign was not always a peaceful reign. Okay. Uh, uh, and part of, of his punishment uh, uh, with uh, the sin that he committed with that Sheba was that would be trouble in his own home. Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen. Not only did a brother kill a brother, but his son Absalom tried to overthrow him and wrestle the kingdom from him. It is during this time that, that David finds himself, if I can use the phrase, in sorrow back. All right, mm -hmm. Trouble seemed to be on every side, uh, uh, in the home and within his body, and, and folks were starting to be concerned about whether he deserved to be king because Absalom was standing between him and the people. Yeah. And David is facing some problems. Mm -hmm. But he said this time, yeah. I believe he turned to himself and said, I need to trust we hear you? in the Lord. Yes. Amen. Amen. Yes. Sister Gwen, four things today. <laughs> Amen. I'm going to be out of here. <laughs> Amen. When we, when we start uh, uh, seriously considering why we need to trust in God. 
first of all, well, uh, he says that there are going to be evil doers. Yes, sir. There are evil doers. There are some folks, yeah, that don't believe in God. Yes, sir. There are some folks that's going to do you wrong. There are some folks that's going to take advantage yes, of you. Yes. Uh -huh. uh, 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 it seems like, yeah, that some of those folks that, that as wrong as they're living, they never go to church, but it seems like they prosperous in everything that they do. They yeah. take advantage of us. And, and, and David says, I'm not going to worry about yes, sir. them folks. Uh, uh, and don't you worry about them. Amen. You need to Place your trust in God. Yes. That's the first thing you need to do is place your trust in God. He said, don't worry about the wicked and don't envy them. Uh, 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 I tell, I tell young folks, you might see that fella driving that nice car with the big rims and, and he might have some bling in his mouth and he may have some money in his pocket, but you, you better not go that way because there's something waiting for him yes, sir. <laughs> that's not good. I hear you. Right. Amen. I don't care how much money you got. Mm -hmm. it, it, it don't do you any good in prison. I, 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 I was, that was an, an incident that occurred some years ago, amen, uh, uh, where uh, a young fellow uh, got into the drug business. Yeah, he... Uh, Doing quite well, selling drugs. Uh, had 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 a claim some children that he had that he disowned. But once uh, uh, the parent, the mother was dead, they claimed the child, or he claimed the children because he'd get a check. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Amen. Right. And he used the check to start his drug business. And he had a lucrative drug business, Brother Fred. Uh, 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 he, he, he had stashed some money away, he'd get out of jail money. Uh, 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 but I tell you, I, 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 I tell you, even this just ain't going to win. Well, uh, tell me that when the law came to get him, yeah, the feds came and got him, and they, they took everything that he had, and then they went to his mother's house and found the safe with his get out of jail money and took it to Amen. And they locked him up. Amen. Don't, don't be envious of those folks because the Bible said they like grass. Yeah, yeah. It's gonna fade away. Amen. 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 So 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 first thing is place your trust in God. Yeah. Don't worry about the wicked. And, and then the second point is to trust in God and do good. Uh, uh, the, the, the psalmist said, trust in the Lord and do good, so shall thou dwell in the land, and fairly thou shalt be fed. If you trust in the Lord, believe in him, then you will live in safety. Yes. Yeah, uh, uh, you will be able to receive the blessing from God when you do good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Amen. The Bible teaches us a very, a very prominent precept. When when it says that a man soweth, that shall he also reap. Yes. And if you trust in the Lord and do good, then the Lord will bless you by doing good to you and for you and causing those people around you to do good to you. Wow. Amen. Amen. Then, then he says, uh, 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 delight in the, the law. Uh, uh, we should take comfort, take the delight in, in trusting God and doing for him. Okay. Uh, uh, if you delight yourself in the Lord, and that word delight means that you, you're committed to him. You're, you're trusting in him. Your joy comes from you serving the Lord. Yes, sir. And when you find joy in serving God, the scripture says he'll give you the desires of your heart. Yes. Uh, he didn't say uh, God will give you what you need or what you want. Mm -hmm. 
He give you the desires of your heart. If you're living a good life and you're trusting God and you're delighting in him and, and being joyful and thankful and committing yourself to him, then he's bound to bless you. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. I heard him when he said that earthly fathers can give good gifts. Mm -hmm. Then how much more can your heavenly father yes, sir. give you good gifts? Mm -hmm. Amen. So we need to learn to delight ourselves in the Lord. And I'm about through, but this fourth thing. We need to commit our ways unto him. Yes, sir. Everything that we do, we need to commit them to the Lord. Stop saying, I'm going to do it myself. Well, well. It's pretty good when you say it's the Lord's will. Then we shall do it. That's what the Bible says. Uh, if it's the Lord's will, yeah, yeah. then he will bless us. Yeah, when you commit everything that we do unto him and we trust him to get it done. It's kind of like having faith. I have faith in God and I trust him. So I'm going to step out in faith. Scripture says we walk by faith and not by sin. Yes, so I'm going to trust him now, right. as I take my first step. I'm trusting him and I know he will help me. Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah, because he's concerned about me. Yes. Yeah, I'm going to commit my way unto him mm -hmm. because he will use our righteousness uh, as a testimony to aid us in going about our way. Yes, sir. Have you ever thought about that some folks help you because you live right? Some folks help you because of the testimony yes, that sir. other folks have about you. Right. They'll say, Brother Tell is a good man, yeah. so I'm going to help him. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. Brother Kirby, he'll reach out to do things for yes, you, sir. so I'm going to help him. Uh, Brother Fred is a likable fella, uh, so I'm going to endorse him. Uh, yeah, and that's God uh, using people uh, to help you along the way. Uh, if you commit uh, your way under him uh, and do everything you can uh, in him, uh, then the Bible says uh, those folks that are against you, uh, he will, uh, yeah, uh, he arrange justice uh, down on them. Uh, yeah, he'll bring forth uh, thy righteousness uh, and light uh, and thy judgment at noonday. Uh, yeah. You'll be able to see plainly uh, that the Lord is uh, on your side. Uh, if you just trust him, uh, I come to tell you, uh, he will, uh, yeah, make a way for you. Uh, yeah, we got record on that. Uh, that if you trust in the Lord, uh, he will uh, see you through. Uh, come in, Moses, I, I need a little help. Uh, Moses trusted uh, in the Lord. Uh, there they are now uh, at the Red Sea. Uh, yeah, God has delivered them uh, out of Egypt, uh, leading them to the Promised Land. Uh, they get to the Red Sea, uh, and the mountains are uh, on both sides. Uh, Pharaoh behind them, uh, the Red Sea in front of them, uh, and the people begin to murmur. Uh, but I hear God, uh, I ask Moses, uh, what's that in your hand? Uh, yeah, is that a rod? Uh, then stretch forth the rod. Uh, I hear Moses, uh, what the Bible say. Uh, Moses told the people, uh, stand still uh, and you'll see the salvation uh, of the Lord. Uh, but I translate that for you. Moses told the people uh, just trust God uh, and he will uh, deliver you. Uh, the Bible says uh, he stretched forth his rod uh, and the Red Sea parted uh, and they went across uh, on dry land. Uh, that's because uh, they trusted God. Uh, yeah, if you trust the Lord, uh, he will uh, make a way for you. Come here, Job. Uh, can you help me now? Uh, Job said, uh, yeah, Satan uh, afflicted me. I uh, took everything uh, that I had, uh, took all of my possessions, uh, took my children, uh, took my wife, uh, took 
my helper, the sister in sackcloth and ashes. Uh, didn't have uh, nobody uh, that really understood uh, what I was going through. Uh, but I trusted uh, in the Lord. Uh, I hear him when he say, uh, though he slay me, uh, yet shall I trust him. Uh, the Bible says uh, that after Job uh, got through going through uh, his trials and tribulations, uh, that the Lord blessed him uh, with twice more uh, than he had before uh, because he trusted uh, uh, in the Lord, uh, I hear uh, David say uh, in the 24th Psalm, uh, Yeah, though I walk uh, through the valley of the shadow of death, uh, I'm going to fear no evil uh, for you with me. Uh, I'm trusting uh, in the Lord. Uh, I believe uh, at that stage uh, in David's life, uh, death had been uh, on his track uh, many times. Uh, when the lion came, uh, there was death coming for him. Uh, but God prevailed in him. Uh, when the bear came, uh, death came again. Uh, but the Lord uh, enabled him uh, to overpower the bear. Uh, when he stood uh, before Goliath, uh, death came uh, to take his life. Uh, but God enabled him uh, to prevail. Uh, so now he can say, uh, I trust the Lord. Uh, yes, I walk uh, through the valley of the shadow of death. No evil, Master, for I know you're with me. Have you learned uh, to trust in the Lord? Uh, he will uh, make a way for you. I'm on my way to a seat now, but I hear you back uh, say to those uh, down in Judah, I, I know uh, that things are tough now. What did he say? Uh, he said, I know the fig tree uh, is not going to blossom. Uh, I know it won't be. Uh, it is fruit on the vine. Uh, the olives, uh, they're going to fail. Uh, there'll be uh, no feed, no food uh, in the field. Uh, yeah, the fold, uh, the sheep won't be uh, in the fold. Uh, but I got to tell you, uh, Rebecca said, yet uh, I will trust uh, in the Lord. Uh, yeah, I'm going to trust in him uh, because I know uh, he will uh, make a way. Uh, I trust in him uh, because he's able to sustain me. I trust in him uh, because he will uh, make a way for me. Uh, I gotta tell you now, uh, even uh, Jesus uh, trusted in God. Uh, yes, he did. Uh, how you know he trusted in God? Uh, because he gave up uh, his glory, uh, divested himself, uh, gave up the power that he had uh, and tabernacle, uh, yeah, down on the earth uh, for three years uh, as a man, uh, gave up his glory uh, and became a man uh, so that he could uh, give uh, his life uh, as a ransom for our sins. Uh, he trusted the Lord uh, to take care of him. Uh, well, how you know uh, on the cross, uh, yeah, we hear him say, Father, in the down hand, uh, I commend my spirit. Uh, I can't trust uh, nobody else with it. Uh, I got 11 men uh, that have been with me, uh, but I can't trust him uh, with my spirit. Uh, number one, uh, it is too much uh, for them to hold. Uh, I can't uh, trust an angel uh, because they might uh, fault and fail uh, like Satan did. Uh, so finally in the down hand, uh, I commend my spirit uh, and he trusted God uh, with his spirit and dropped his head uh, in a lock of his shoulder and died. Uh, yes, he did uh, on Calvary's cross for your sins uh, and my sins. But let me tell you, that ain't the end of the story. Uh, the third day morning, uh, when he got up, uh, God said, Here's your spirit. Uh, back you trusted me with it. Uh, I'm giving it back to you. Not just your spirit, uh, but all power in heaven and earth. Uh, I'm giving it back to you now. Uh, whatever you want to do, you can do it. You trusted me. And I trust you with all power. Yeah. In your hands. I trust yes. in the Lord. Yes. If God is good enough for Jesus to trust, yes. then I'm going to trust him. Yes. Trust him 
until I die. Songwriter says, I trust in God wherever I may be. Upon the land or upon the rolling sea. For come what may from day to day, I know my Heavenly Father watches over me. Over me. Yeah. Over me. Yeah. I can trust Him. Because he's watching over me. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Can you trust him? Yeah. Will you trust him? He's worthy of your trust. Yes. If you just commit your way unto him, yeah. then he'll give you the desire of your heart. What? Now, we are mere human beings, and we have a case of the woke mode. <laughs> Amen. So yeah. full of talks, talk about you. Uh, 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 you just like toys, yeah, yeah. You uh, uh, folks know I got me a new toy. Amen. That that's what she calls it. It's not a car. It's a toy. She calls it. <laughs> Amen. And and, and 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 we like stuff. Amen. So so God says you should trust me. Commit your ways unto me. Then I give you the desire. Of your heart. All right now. What you want, I give to you. But you gotta trust him. Yeah. All right. Gotta depend on him. Amen. And stop worrying about what self can do. Yeah. Right. Cause self would do nothing but mess you up. That's right. Amen. Be like the old tale that that the uh, um, self will get you out on that tree limb. Amen. And all you hear is zuba zuba zuba. Life sawing the branch off. <laughs> Amen. 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 Trust in God. Yeah. Trust in the Lord. Mm -hmm. And He will take care of you. Yeah. He'll provide for you. You won't have to worry about stuff, things, because whatever you need, God's got it. Yeah. Yeah. If you're here today or listening over the airway, I uh, come to tell you today, I encourage you, ask you, beg of you, beseech you to trust in the Lord. Yeah. Amen. Don't wait until uh, it's too late. Right. Trust Him now. Uh, and you'll find out hmm. that whatever you have to face, He'll go through it with you. Yeah. Yeah. And you'll be able to come out being blessed. Yeah. That's our message. Yeah. That is our message. Trust in God. Yeah. Trust Amen. in the Lord. Trust in Jesus. A little bit more personal. Trust the Holy Spirit. Right. Amen. He's within us to help us, yeah. to guide us, to teach us. So if he's with us, why can't we trust him? Amen. Amen. And I come to tell you, he talks to us. Oh, yeah. Yes, he does. He talks to you. He'll tell you, don't do that. Yes, he will. He'll tell you, don't go there. Yes, he will. He'll tell you, you did wrong, make it right. Yes, he does. Amen. If you learn to trust while the song is sung. Amen. Say that. Yeah. Say it like you mean it. Yeah.
expression of your grace, your love, and your mercy. Yes. Thank you for allowing us to meet on this day at this place on this occasion mm -hmm. to worship and praise your holy name. Bless us, O oh God, as we have come and worship you. Bless those that are at home. Yes. Pray, O oh God, that you would protect us, keep us, shield us, help us, Master, to trust in you. Yes. Knowing, Lord, that when we trust in you and we commit our ways unto you, when we do good, when we rest in you, when we delight ourselves in you, Lord, you will take care of us, provide for us the things that we not only have need of, but what our hearts desire. Yes. Thank you, O oh God, Thank for you, Lord. these that are here. We pray again, Master, for those that are sick, mm -hmm. especially those of the minority family. Yes. yes. Bless, yes. heal, make whole, in the name of Jesus. Now, Father God, is we pray that you would bless these gifts that have been given. Bless the giver of the gifts. We thank you, Lord, and pray that these gifts be used for the upbuilding of your cause. Yes, Lord God, that it may aid in saving others. Yes. Then, Father, when this life is over, and yes. time for us shall be no more, pray that you would meet us in that dying hour. Yes. Take us home to be with you. Pray that your will be done. In Jesus' name we pray. Thank you, Lord. Now we pray that the Lord bless thee. The Lord keep you. The Lord make his face to shine upon you. That the Lord be gracious unto you. Lift up his countenance upon you and give you peace. And every heart say it. Amen. Amen. Amen.